Hi, I appreciate you stopping by again today. We've talked about the five stages of dating. Let's dive a little deeper into the first stage by discussing what initiates and sustains attraction and one of the most important differences between men and women. The levels of attraction a man feels for a woman are the same that a woman feels for a man. However, the ordering of these levels is different and important to understand. Operating within the framework of these variances can give you a boost of confidence, as well as the advantage of hitting the right notes at the right time and saving yourself wasted time and effort in not pursuing the relationships with the wrong women. These attraction levels for men are, number one, physical chemistry. This means that men are attracted to women in their bodies first. Because this level is experienced first, a man must learn to distinguish between the women he is strongly physically attracted to and the subset of women who are attractive and can sustain a relationship with him. Getting your libido under control and putting off physical intimacy to discover if a woman satisfies the other three levels of attraction will ultimately help you to discover the right woman for you more quickly. You'll find that there are many women you find physically attractive, but only a few of those that you can enjoy spending time with as friends. That leads to level two, emotional affection. Deciding that a woman is likable depends on her personality and how it complements or stimulates your personality. We all have different tastes, likes, and dislikes. Ask yourself if you could comfortably spend the day with her and enjoy your time together as friendly companions and still want to see her again. Once you find a woman who is physically attractive and likable, you'll move to level three, mental stimulation. A woman's character how she thinks, feels, and her philosophy of life will either entertain and stimulate you or let you know that you just won't get along well together. At level three, your attraction to her character will bring out the best in you, along with a desire to learn more from her and about her. A single friend of mine tells me that he looks for a woman who can hold up her end of the conversation. He has learned to exercise patience and not get distracted by a woman's beauty or kindness until he knows she can keep up with him mentally as well. At level three, a man will experience that a lot of women are interesting to him, but only a few are outstanding and will have the character that holds his attention. If a woman is not challenging and interesting, you will soon tire of her, no matter how pretty she is. If you are looking for a happy, long-term relationship, then on the first date, make sure the woman meets these three levels of attraction for you, physical, emotional, and mental, before continuing to date her. Once you narrow down the field of women you choose to date to only those who meet these top three levels, you'll find less disappointment and dissatisfaction, and more enjoyment and happiness. At that point, your heart will open, and soon you'll be able to feel level four, soul connection. This soul connection will develop as you move through the additional stages of dating with this person. This covers the four levels of attraction for men, but remember, the four levels for women are a little different. Knowing what a woman is looking for means you can excel in her level one attraction and stand out from the crowd. Here's the big secret. When men are looking for the most beautiful woman in the room, she is looking for the most interesting conversation partner in the room. For women, the levels of attraction start with one, mental stimulation. This means that women are attracted to men in their minds first. A woman imagines what a man is like and is attracted to something in his character. That's why it's so important to present your best, most positive, and interested self when meeting a woman. 
follow the advice from my video covering the five stages of dating, and remember that a woman is interested in a man who is interested in her, and who displays a gentlemanly character. Through your initial conversation, she will decide if you meet level two, emotional affection. Now that her interest has peaked, she wants to know if your personality is compatible and if she feels safe to be her authentic self with you. It's important to be honest and genuine so you can both decide if you like each other. If she feels affection for you, that will lead to level three, physical chemistry. Although a man's appearance and body language will register with a woman from the moment she first sees him, it takes moving through the first two levels before she warms up enough to truly appreciate his features and want to be touched by him. Similarly, if a very handsome man approached and did not connect mentally or emotionally with her, she would find him to be much less physically attractive. Successfully reaching level three means that when a man holds her hand, puts his arm around her, or gives her a kiss, she will experience a rush of desire and delight. Then, at level four, soul connection, she will begin to see a man as lovable and will want to go through the remaining stages of dating with him. We develop discernment by dating new people and deciding who meets the top three levels of attraction before moving on to the next stage of dating. When we learn this discernment and raise our standards, we make sure that we do not compromise and settle for less when we're ready for more. Choosing to date a woman only because she is beautiful, sexually compliant, to make others jealous, because you're lonely and she's available, or other superficial reasons, is a bad idea and can mean never finding real lasting love. It is very confusing to our inner instincts and initiates a negative pattern that makes us become attracted to the wrong types of partners. Additionally, when we choose to pursue someone we know is not right for us, we lose the opportunity to find a better match, waste time and effort, as well as opening ourselves up to heartbreak. That's why it's important to understand and work through the four levels of attraction and the five stages of dating if we want to find a loving, long-lasting relationship that provides fulfillment and happiness. Let me know if you have found the right person by satisfying the four levels of attraction or tell me if you have a difficult situation that you would like help to solve. I'd love to hear from you. Please visit my Patreon page and consider pledging a small amount each month to join our community, receive bonus perks, and support my work. And take a moment now to like this video with a thumbs up, then subscribe and click on the bell to receive notifications when I upload a new video. Thanks for meeting with me. We'll talk again soon. The Softer Side